hey yo welcome back to my channel oh my god y'all so i'm back with another vlog or whatever oh before i get into that i need to start promoting this more second chance approvals by ming yeah if y'all need approvals for houses apartments all that little cool stuff or whatever i need to start promoting it but i don't want to get no long introduction to this vlog as y'all know today is september two thursday september 21st which means what that means my motherfucking birthday is in three motherfucking days and i don't even think i ever well yeah i didn't because i've been slaking with my vlogging but i didn't even tell y'all what i was doing for my birthday i'm actually taking a trip and i'm going out the country for the first time finally putting my little passport to use i'm so happy like i'm so happy about that um but yeah i'm going on a little trip i'm not gonna give it away yet y'all i mean y'all gonna know by the time i drop my next vlog or whatever or and if y'all follow me obviously y'all gonna know i go on my trip tomorrow september 22nd and yeah i'm just so fucking excited but anyway today is gonna be uh basically get ready with me prepare for my birthday trip whatever i'm gonna whatever i'm gonna title the video that's what this video is gonna be so basically y'all know i gotta get the works i always gotta get my nails done feet done eyebrows hair wax all that little cool shit so that's just basically what today is going to be or whatever and i just wanted to take y'all with me i also got to do a, a couple other things like run around i gotta get some stuff from the hair store i gotta go to target to get some like um travel size stuff or whatever so i'm gonna just be doing all of that today so y'all just coming around with me y'all want to ride out with me or no so right now i had um it's actually 12 11 p.m right now i actually had a uh no uh, i'm at a hair appointment no a wax appointment set for like 10 o'clock but i had ended up getting in so late last night that i really couldn't even get up to make it to my appointment not only that somebody made me late anyway but yeah so i just ended up canceling my appointment so i had rescheduled it for 1 30 so because that was all that they, all that they had available so in the meantime while i'm waiting in the meantime while i'm waiting for that appointment i'm gonna just do a little walking at the nail salon um so that's where i'm about to head to now i hope i don't they don't give me a hard time about recording because they are so fucking annoying like seriously i need to find another nail salon but um yeah that's why i'm on my way to now or whatever um and we yeah i'm actually going to get something a little different today because y'all know all i get is white so we just going we just going turn it up a notch do some little classy bitch shit okay not too much but y'all know i need to start going to like regular no, like nail techs they be doing like all the extra designs and shit but yeah for now i'ma just i'ma I'm just stick to my little basic or whatever but i am going to turn it up a notch because i feel like i first of all i do get white all year round it's in on my birthday too so it's like yeah we're just we doing something different this year okay we going out the country we 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 getting our nails different everything different so yeah so right now i'm about to head to the nail salon and it's 12 hopefully they done they be done by then like in time for me to make it to my appointment my wax appointment i'm getting my underarms and my um i'm getting my underarms and my i'm getting a brazilian wax so i'm getting that or whatever and i'm actually getting my eyebrows and my lip wax too in here so but i know they're not gonna let me but they're so annoying like so annoying so yeah that's what we want now so i'm gonna just i'm about to go to the nose salon now and then we're gonna go to our wax appointment so i'm gonna see you when i get in here Be the 
well so we back or whatever my camera head died i was so irritated my camera head died while i was in the middle of getting my eyebrows and my lip wigs it died so i couldn't catch that i had to go back and get a whole new battery because i left all my other battery i don't know what the fuck made me grab one battery instead of grabbing at least three batteries so i could you know keep going but i'm so happy first of all because because the girl did not say nothing about my camera it, it only really be this one man like the girls never say nothing it'd be the one man that working there he'd be so fucking hype but she let me record she ain't say nothing she ain't ask no questions or nothing and she let me record my eyebrows get my lip weights all that but i still got some a part of that cotton ball but yeah she let me record or whatever i was so angry my camera had died because i really wanted to get the whole process but y'all see me get that done before so i don't even care but um yeah i had to reschedule cancel and reschedule my wax appointment like 10 times because i kept thinking i was going to be able to make it at a certain time and i couldn't so i'm finally out of there so now i was able to schedule a wax appointment and they got one that's like 15 minutes from now it's 254 they uh got it i think at 315 so i'm on my way there now but y'all the French tip just gives like rich bitch or something like I don't know I love it on me like it's so just cute and classy and all that the one thing I do got I showed y'all what my toes and my nose look like <laughs> when I was done but the one the, damn they booting the shit out of everybody damn it's like four boots on this block y'all better pay y'all tickets <laughs> Yo, I just rolled past like four boots. What the fuck? But yeah, um, what what the fuck was I about to say? So yeah, the only thing I didn't like about my uh, I I do like my nails. Don't get me wrong. But she had asked me like um that I want a thin or a thick line. So I told her I said do a thin line first so I could see what it looked like. But I feel like. I don't know if she was listening or something but i don't know if she considers this a thin line but i feel like it's like kind of like thick like i feel like if it was just a little thinner i would like it much better but it's really not bad at all it's the thumb i think i think the thumb line is like too thick i don't know but um i do still like them though like i love my nose yo i got cotton y'all know how how they wipe your face your face and your eyebrows and shit with cotton and alcohol or cotton and oil when you done that cotton is like i feel it in my nose I feel it in my mouth, like, but, um, yeah, I do like the nose. I just feel like she could have made the lines a little thinner, but I honestly, I honestly was in a fucking rush. Um, I honestly didn't even think that I was like, I don't know. It was just so much going on. I'm mad because I really wanted to get a pedicure, but I was in such a rush because I thought I had to do this one other thing, but I didn't. But by the time I found out, I didn't have to do it no more. It was already too late for the pedicure so it's like fuck it whatever my feet ain't crusty anyway but i'm gonna get that i'm gonna get a pedicure when i come back uh for my birthday trip because um i wanted to do like a whole like self-care vlog but like a real self-care vlog like i'm talking about i ain't talking about nails i mean that's all cool too but i'm talking about like massages facials saunas all that like the real the real self-care the, the real luxury self-care so i'm actually looking for a spot to go to i low-key want to go to like one that's like in new york or something but i don't know but um yeah so that's what's going on yeah i just wanted to let y'all know what's going on so i'm sitting here getting my i'm about to get my wax now and then my hair appointment is at 4 30 so after my wax i gotta go home take snatch this busted ass shit out because i don't know if y'all can tell but i did it myself and i had it in much longer than i was supposed to which is why i got a head on but i just refuse to get my hair done because i'm not going to get if y'all see me touching my nose it's really because i feel all this cotton in my fucking face but um yeah um then what was i about to say oh yeah what was i about to say oh yeah i had did this myself but i ain't never take it out because i wasn't about to get my hair done when like my birthday is coming up why would i get my hair done when i'm about to get my hair done now for my birthday then after my birthday i could go back to my regular schedule you know hair done every two to three weeks whatever but it's like right now it's like i'm not about to i wasn't about to get my hair done to turn around and take it out and get my hair done again so i just had this little braid in or whatever but it's so ready to go like my hair is busted sweated out and every fucking thing else so yeah but um so yeah after this wax appointment i'm gonna go back in the house take my hair out wash it blow dry it and be on my way down there i really need to eat something i'm hungry as shit honestly but 
I don't know what to eat. I'm still dieting. I've been on a strict ass diet and I've been doing so good since like it was definitely more than a month. I feel like it's been like two months for real, for real. Like I just been dieting and I'm just so tired of eating the same shit. Salads and salmon and baked chicken. It's like I'm so tired and I'm trying to, trying to, trying to, trying to. I mean, I have been doing it, but I, I'm really trying to like stay away from like red meat or whatever because I know people be saying like that's not good for you. But I love me some steak and I'm really about to switch over to that because I'm tired of eating the same shit. I'm tired of chicken, salmon. What the fuck else is it? I I I do eat pork. I'm not gonna lie. I do eat pork, but I haven't ate pork. Like I haven't ate pork, and like I eat like I just don't be eating. Like I just be sticking to the basic stuff, and I just be getting silence and shit. Like eating vegetables stuff like that. But I'm so tired today. But I said after my birthday, it's up. Like once I get the oh no, I can't tell you where I'm going. But once I get there and taste that like authentic food. I'm back in my bag. Like, I'm done dieting. I'm done all this shit. Like, I'm just done with it. Like, I'm fed up with it. I'm tired of doing it. I hate that I don't have a car meal. But, y'all know, my car is down in Atlanta. Still. So, when I'm up here, I don't be driving my own car. So, it's like, I don't want to buy, like, a car meal for this car. Because it's not my car. So, like, I don't know, y'all. But, um, yeah, that's what's going on, you know. I'm on my way to my wax appointment. I'm about to get a Brazilian wax, and I'm going to also get my under... This is a, such a bad angle. Um, I'm going to get a Brazilian wax, and I'm going to get my um, underarms wax, too. And then I'm going to go in the house, wash my hair, blow dry it, and, yeah. We're going to do that. So, I'm going to catch y'all when we get to the wakes appointment. I'm not going to record. I'm going to let y'all know now. I'm not recording me taking the hair out. Wash I'm not doing all of that because that's pointless and just too much. And just, no. So, I'm going to see y'all at the wakes. And then, if I don't talk to y'all, I'm going to meet y'all at our hair appointment. I find the why, give me what you need me. I know what you like. I feel it coming. Time is up to guess that. I try to need you. But I need some last time. I need your game. Yo, first of all, let me tell you how I'm hurt. It's 3.50 p.m. right now, right? My wake's appointment was at 3.15. Why the fuck am I this name getting out of there? So, it was already a red flag when the bitch, I go in there. I don't go fuck if people take offense to it or not. The first thing that I do when I go get a wake is I'm, I'm asking you how long you've been doing this and all that. Like, I'm getting in your business because you're about to rip my fucking skin off so i need to know if you know how to do it the right way so i asked her the bitch said two weeks so she like so i'm like two weeks she said oh no i just been at this location for two weeks i feel like she was fucking lying y'all because that was just the worst weeks i got in my fucking life first of all bitch what the fuck took you 35 minutes well no 30 minutes because i got out of there at 345 what the fuck took you 30 minutes to wax me Granted, I got my underarms in my my uh, Brazilian wax, but and I got my underarms in my Brazilian wax, but even still, it never takes that long. I get wax consistently, so it's not nothing that you gotta put all this time and effort into, cause I get wax consistently. So it's like, what this took you thirty five minutes to do a thirty minutes to do a wax? She didn't know what the fuck she was doing. She went over the same spot like 20 fucking times when the hair was all going. Like, I guess she didn't want to, like, you know how, like, if you get well for the waxers out there, y'all know that, like, if you get waxed or whatever, it might be, like, some little, like, hairs, like, that might not come up so they'll tweeze it. And I guess instead of her wanting to tweeze it, she decided to keep waxing it. It took her, and I'm sitting here like, yo, 
In my head, I'm like, this bitch taking so fucking long. Then she didn't know how to do it. It just felt, I mean, waxing always feel bad. So it's like, that part wasn't nothing new. But it's just like, sometimes, sometimes it's like worse than others. Then my underarms, she, uh, yeah, it was just a mess, y'all. Like a mess. So now I'm sitting here rushing because my hair appointment is at 4.30. It's 3.52. I still got to go in the house, take my hair out. Not that as much to it, but I still gotta take my hair out, wash my hair, and blow dry it. What fucking time am I about to head to the bed? Cause the place I just got wet, it's like 25 minutes away from where I'm going. So, like, it said I'm gonna get there at 4:12. That's gonna leave me with like what? No time. I definitely don't got time to get food. So I'm definitely about to be sitting there for all these hours, fucking starving. But I don't have no time to do nothing. Like barely wash my and I'm mad because when I wash my hair, I like to um I like to um like take a shower before I go get my hair done. Like right before I get my hair done because I don't know why, but I just do it. Like I like to take like a like a a shower before I don't know. I'm not even gonna have time to do that. And I don't want to get in a shower after my hair is done when it's freshly done. Like, I want to get in a shower before my hair is done. Like, like I know a lot of people might think that's weird, but I don't know why I always got to take a shower before my hair is done. Like, it's, it's, I can't explain it. I can't explain it, but it's just like, a, like, I have to do it that way. Like, I don't, I don't know why. So, I'm irritated because I'm not going to have time for that. So, now... It's just so annoying. Like, it's just so irritating. I'm just so irritated because I don't like feeling rushed. And, like, my anxiety is just going. I'm glad my nails are out the way, my wax out the way. But I don't want to be late to my hair, like, too, too late to my hair appointment. I'm probably about to just wash. But this is exactly why y'all need to be washing hair, though. Like, honestly. Because if y'all wash hair, I wouldn't even be going through this whole dilemma. Now I got to sit here and rush to hurry up and wash my hair and blow dry it. I'm probably not gonna blow dry it though. She probably gonna have to do that because I don't like I don't really know what to tell you. But then still gotta drive to my hair appointment. I'm not gonna have no time to get there. Like it's four to say I'm gonna get there, get to the house at four twelve. So now I gotta run in here and wash my like I'm just irritated. Like there's just too much going on, y'all. But I don't know. I guess I see you at my hair appointment or something. I'm about to start feeling burnt out. I hate feeling burnt out, y'all. All right, y'all. False alarm. I'm so happy. I'm done talking shit about hairstylists. Because y'all hairstylists ain't fucking with my stylists. So I know it, but y'all. So I texted. I said, hey, I might be like five minutes late because I'm on, I'm on my way uh, to go. I'm on my way in to go wash my hair. She said, you know I wash hair, right? No, I didn't know that. But now I am. Now, now I know. So now I don't have to rush. I could just go in the house, go get my hair, and yeah, I'm happy because that's one last thing I don't have to do. So now I could go there and I could probably get some food too because I'm really honestly craving Wendy's right now. And it's a Wendy's right next to her shop. So yeah, that's what it's giving. I didn't know she watched hair though, y'all, but I'm happy. So I can't talk shit about your stylist. Well, I can talk shit about the rest of you, but I can't. Yeah, my my stylist, you're, you're not her. Period. So I'ma see you. I don't know. I'm about to go to Wendy's. I'm probably not even about to vlog or that. But I'ma see you. I'm about to go get my hair and stuff and meet you at the hair salon. Yo, why well, it's 4:31 and I'm not there? I'm not even nowhere near there. Dude. Because I just had to take a shower and do all this extra shit. But it say it say I'll be there in um, ten minutes. But I'm just irritated because this day is just not flowing how it's supposed to flow. Like I hate feeling like I hate feeling like rushed and like my anxiety is kicking in and shit like that because it's like I'm trying to do too much. That's why I just want to hurry up and have my hair be finished. Like because it's like. I don't know. My mind is in a million places right now. And I'm just irritated. Like, I'm just so fucking irritated. Because, like, there's just too much unnecessary shit going on. Like, I should have been there a long time ago. 
But anyway, I'm going to be there. Let's say I'm going to be there in nine minutes. I'm going to be getting here at 441. So, mm, I text her. Hopefully, she won't be. I don't think she going to triple. I just don't like having people. I, then again, she do always got me waiting. But still, I just don't like having people waiting. My body all fucking wet. I, got in the, I just got in the shower with this. So, that's why I look like that. I'm going to buy oh, wet. Then I wash my face again. I don't know why I washed my Well, I, I had to because I had the wax on there. But I washed my face three times in like the last like 12 hours. I came home at like 3, 3 in the morning when I did all my little, you know, self-care stuff. I washed my face. Then I washed my face when I woke up. Then I just washed my face again. But anyway, yeah, I'm just irritated because Wendy's is literally right here. But I'm literally going to have no time to go because I'm already, it's already my appointment time. And I'm not there. So I'm definitely not going to have time to go to Wendy's. Like, I'm just irritated, y'all. I'm so hungry. I ain't eat all day. Like, nothing. I ain't even drink nothing all day. I'm just sitting here chewing gum. Like, that's so irking. Like, I just want to relax while I get my hair done. But now, like, my stomach going to be touching my back the whole time. And that's just annoying as fuck. Morning, you're in the morning. Well, I need you now. Yeah, yeah, I find the one, give me the one you need me, I know what you like. I feel it coming, time is up to guess that, I try to need you. All right, you know, so I just left the shop. It's 7.44. So y'all know earlier how I was telling you I had to go to the hair store and then I had to go to Target too. 
I'm so irritated. I should have just did all this shit early this morning. I don't fucking know. But I'm on my way to do that now. It's actually 7.44. I was going to go to another hair store. But I feel like all the fucking hair stores closed at 7 o'clock and it's 7.44. So, I'm about to go to this one that's like five minutes away from my stylist. And they close at 8.30. So, I'm going to just go there or whatever. And then, I'm going to give me something to eat. Because my stomach is touching my fucking back. Cause Wendy's is, and Wendy's is in the same uh, parking lot as the hair store, so that's just a one-stop shop for real. Um, after that, I'm gonna go. I actually had ordered this tripod off of Amazon, like the kind that, that's like flexible and it look like like octopus or whatever they call it. Um, I had got a new tripod and I want to actually go get that before I go to Target so I could wrap the tripod around the shopping cart so like my vlogs when I'm shopping could be better yeah so that's what we about to do but how y'all like my hair though my camera is about to die when I go get my tripod I'm gonna get a new battery too but oh my god I gotta go to the fucking hair store and my battery about to die <laughs> I'm so irritated hold on do you slide on all your nights like this do you try on all your nights like this Y'all got a uh, travel size spritz. Yeah. Where's your mannequin go? Do you slide on all your nights like this? Do you try on all your nights like this? Put some spotlight on the side. And whatever comes, comes through clear. All this jewelry ain't no use when this gets dark. It's my favorite part, we see the lights they got so far It went too fast, we couldn't reach it with the uh, uh, uh. Is this all I need? Wrist on the wrist and link a charm Laying wrist still and link a paw uh, like We could try to go for a time and bring the island like this uh, uh, uh. If we could see in 2010 Twice we could see it till the end It's my life All right, Joel. So I'm in Wendy's parking lot, right? Let me tell y'all how I go in the house to get a new camera battery. I was supposed to get my new tripod so I could wrap the tripod around the cart so y'all could come shop with me. How about I leave the fucking tripod? But I'm like, that was too much to do any fucking way. So it is what it is. Y'all always go to Target with me or go anywhere with me without me having a tripod. So it is what it is. We still gonna go to Target. I just need something in my stomach. It is. 821 and I still did not eat shit so that's what we about to do I'm about to get some food I'm at Wendy's right now I'm about to try to find the healthiest option cause y'all I've been on a strict I told y'all I think I told y'all earlier I've been on a strict diet for like two months this lighting is not cute on me this lighting is not cute on me but back to what I was saying before my camera died y'all like my hair I know I didn't go all out you know I didn't get no color last year I had blonde the year before that I had uh brown with honey highlights and shit like that like i ain't i ain't really do too much this year i just wanted to do like a deep side part but i just know like what look i was going for it so it was like i'm gonna just do this because a lot of things is different this year y'all like i didn't even do a birthday photo shoot y'all know since like what 2019 no 28 2018 I've been do no I think I missed I, I did miss 2019 too I missed 2019 because that was the year I had my baby so I was all over the place but since 2018 almost every year except for that one year 2019 I've been doing birthday photo shoots y'all know how I be coming with the shoots like and I it kind of upset me this year that I didn't do one but honestly the reason why I wasn't pressed is because I ran out of ideas like I didn't really know really what I wanted to do because I'm over the naked photo shoots the half naked photo shoots like this shit is just like it was cool when i was doing it is what i'm saying so if you ain't do it at that point then it's just like kind of like and then when i see him i just be like that's a mess like a hot tacky ass mess like i feel like i killed mine but i'm just saying like now people keep doing them and i'm like y'all need something new to do like it's 2023 y'all still doing lingerie shoots and fucking half naked photo shoots and naked photos and it's like now it's like that wave 
not that it was ever a wave but it was just like the time passed to do this like now we all getting older like why the fuck is your bitches still taking your clothes off i don't know but i just feel like i'm just over that face it's like if i do another naked photo shoot i just feel like at that point i'm sending the wrong message because bitch why you can't put, never put no clothes on like i don't know but before it was like i feel like before it was like making a statement now it was just like bitch no i don't know if y'all get what i'm saying but like i'm just over that whole phase like the naked photo shoot phase have naked photo shoot and bitches be feeling like that's the only birthday look it is i guess i'm bitches because i can't think of nothing else to do not i mean last year i didn't do a half naked photo shoot i was very cute and classy looking with my blonde hair and my little cuban links and all that and my white uh fur or whatever but um i don't know this year honestly what i wanted to do this year i wanted to do like a natural photo shoot like uh, um i was going to get like a slick back ponytail and i was probably even going i think i was going to do the shoot with like no makeup but it's like i don't know i wasn't really pressed i don't know i am going to drop a photo shoot damn did i do a photo shoot this year i ain't do no photo shoots this year i don't think but yeah um i don't know but i'm so tired y'all my eyes are so fucking heavy i really just want to get this food go to target real quick and i hope i'm in and out of there because i'm honestly tired as fuck like i'm so sleepy right now my eyes are so heavy and i still gotta go home and like pack my makeup so it's like i could probably go home and like take a nap honestly because it is only eight o'clock by the time i get home it'll probably be like 9 30 and i could probably just go to sleep like take a nap um because honestly i need to get some sleep in anyway because i honestly feel like for the next three days this is all the, the most sleep i'm gonna get because i'm when i get to my destination we outside you know? like we is the fuck outside we outside not in hi can i get a uh a, a, a wrap the grilled chicken wrap just a wrap for the meal um you could do the meal with a chili i can't really hear you up. can you do the meal with a chili you said chili to the milk, but what's crispy? Chili. With chili? Yeah, instead of fries. Okay, and what's your drink? Um, a, a lemonade, light ice. What's lemonade? Natural, strawberry, blueberry, pomegranate, pineapple, mango? Yeah, natural. Okay, and what else? And, um, uh, can you put, put cheese in the chili, like extra cheese? Cheese and the chili? Yeah, a lot of cheese. Okay, it's enough. That's it. Okay, you can pull it in. I'd be halfway eating healthy or I heard you could eat chili though. Like I heard chili is good, like for you to eat. My at least that's what my mom told me. She done been the one. We always fake diet you know? But she didn't tell me I could eat chili because that's not nothing but beans and meat. For real. But I should have never got the cheese. That'd be my problem. Like I could eat a salad all day, but the salad gotta be fully loaded. Like, so it's like, basically when I'm, when it's all said and done, this shit, like it'd be defeating the whole purpose. But honestly, this is like the first thing I got that's like outside of my diet. Like I just got a wrap and a chili. But I heard that both of those things is okay to eat though. But like these last two months, I've been strictly sticking to meat, vegetables, salads. And for breakfast, I eat oatmeal, but that's pretty much it like i really ain't been doing shit so i don't know i feel so weak right i think that's why i'm so tired because i haven't eaten anything all day eating drinking anything like i'm so hungry i'm not even really thirsty i'm just hungry as shit like i need something in my stomach and then hopefully when we get to target i got better energy but anyway how y'all feeling oh y'all know i didn't even y'all know who want to hear they make extensions don't play with it do not play with it. They make extensions on the hair every time. Don't even play with me. Yo, I got some real, real live good ass hair. Like, good ass hair. And not to mention, I don't know if y'all seen how long it is, but y'all gonna see like when I stand up eventually, probably in my next video, whatever, but y'all gonna see how long it is. This is only two 20 inch bundles. Two 20 inch bundles. I ain't had to put no extra hair in or nothing in this longest shit. Like my hair is not the average, like the side, the, like the length that it says it is. Like you know how some people would say something, say it's like oh 20 inches and that shit look like it's like 16 or some shit like that. No, mine is like 20 and it should be looking like 24. Okay, it's damn near in my waist. Like so, 
yeah but i'm so tired though i'm so tired drained exhausted i've been up and out all day i woke up at like eight o'clock mind you i didn't even get in the house until like three o'clock in the morning ended up waking up because i'm one of them people where my body just naturally wake up i could go to sleep at four o'clock and be up at seven just because that's just what my body choose to do yo i've been up all day i'm so exhausted like so exhausted I just wish I did all of this part, like the hair store target, all this shit. I wish I did this shit this morning, but I don't know. My day kind of got messed up, but whatever. Hi, you for Lucy. Let me know you fix Thank you. This a regular lemonade? I'm sorry? This regular lemonade? You want a regular? This is a kind of Oh, wait. I ain't said it. Thank you. Try to tell me what I say, bitch. You said pineapple mango. Mm -mm -mm. I'm so tired. I hope this Target trip is in and out because when I went to the hair store, I... thank you. When I went to the hair store, I didn't even get everything I was going to get because I, I was going to get a travel size spritz. I actually did get the whole and spray. I was going to get the spritz, but I didn't get that. Um, I was gonna get Travis size spritz. I was gonna get it was a couple things I was gonna get. I'm so happy I didn't forget that fucking eyeliner though because if I forgot that I'd have been assed out so these but I have eyeliner though, that's the crazy part. But the pencil is like I need a sharpener. It's time to sharpen the pencil and I don't have a sharpener, so I just went and bought a whole new eyeliner. But my eye, my eyeliner oh no, no no that one don't come with a sharpener. The first one I picked up came with a sharpener. But that one didn't say eyeliner on it, so I didn't wanna pick that up because I ain't I ain't know. Thank you. Um, can I get um the crackers and a lot of hot sauce? Bro, can I get a lot of hot sauce? Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, Joe, I got my food. I ain't gonna lie, I'm about to pull, pull that right here real quick. I need a bite. <laughs> I'm starving. Yo. Oh, y'all can't even. This shit is so messy. I want to show y'all, but I don't know if y'all can see that. Mm -mm -mm. I got my chili. With cheese. And you gotta get the hot sauce, y'all. They hot sauce so good. Like, so, so good. They ain't good. And this, that's what you gotta do. You gotta crumble your crackers up. I'm on some super fat shit right now. Like, I need to be on my way to Target and I can't even. Hold up. Y'all, yeah, when we get the target, I'm back again and there's Mixie at this target. I'm so irritated. I forgot my tripod. That was the whole purpose. So, I'm trying to find the travel section so we can get our stuff. Where the travel size section? Travel like like um what you mean by travel like two piece? No, like travel size uh like 
two paces and stuff like that. Alright, thank you. I low key want to get another toothbrush. But I don't know. But I'm gonna get. Let me see. Do they got like travel size toothbrushes? Because I would just get that instead of taking my road toothbrush. Hey. I can't even be picky with the two piece. I think I'm gonna just get this. I'm not gonna get this. Get it. This is just so I had something for my face. I really don't care what it is. My face is not. All right, Joe, so now all I need is lotion and deodorant. Well, the size of the deodorant don't matter. And I need soap too. The size of the deodorant don't matter though, I don't think. You can have any size de deodorant, I think, but it's the lotion. I need to get a travel size lotion. And it don't look like they have nothing. Um. I wonder if I need lotion, I need soap, and I need, I think that's it. Hold on, let me check my list. Because I made a list, because I be adult and, you know. So now I had to make sure I ain't forget nothing. Um, lotion. Yeah, lotion. I probably honestly just take one of my deodorants from home because I got so many, like, because I always buy like two at a time, and you know deodorant lasts a long time, so I probably either just use one of mine from home. I would just go and buy a new one, but oh, they do got deodorant. Let me see, but I don't use. That's what I'm saying. I don't want to go there smelling like nothing that I don't smell like. This is all they got: sweet pea violet. Hey, I'm cool. Oh, they got Dove deodorant. I wouldn't be against using it. I love Dove, everything. Yeah, I'll probably just get one of these because you can never go wrong with Dove. Like, let me be the first to tell you that. It don't matter what the product is. If it say Dove, get it. I will use anything they got Dove on it. That's just my go-to. Um... Like, I'm not scared. You know how certain stuff you'd be scared to use because it's like, you don't know how your skin going to take to it. I don't think I ever had Dove, deod Dove deodorant, but Dove just agree with my body so well with everything else, so why not? So I think I'm going to get this. And then I need lotion and soap. <laughs> I'm crackhead. That boy over there don't know which condoms to pick out. Mm, where's the lotion? Lotion and soap. Then that's crazy because I'm in the deodorant aisle and the deodorant I do use, they don't even got it. They don't even got the one I use. Just looking at some stickers for the kids. But I smell like a man. See, I just seen the second person that I know. That's exactly why I hate coming to this fucking. I don't like coming to this Target. It's so fucking mixy. He's like, I'm not judging you, but where's the soul? But it sure feels. It's no like they. There's no bar soap or nothing. What the hell? Like literally. This is crazy. Alright, I only got three minutes left to record, so we're gonna make this quick. I'm gonna go grab my lotion and we're gonna check out and I'm gonna talk to you.
Yo, I just had to get back on here real quick to show y'all how they really don't have shit. They don't have no lotion or nothing. This how you know this Target is mixy, because they don't never have shit. Like, y'all look like y'all having a going out of business sale or something. Like, the shelves is empty as fuck. I'm so irritated. Yo, this is about to be so fucking ghetto, but I honestly think I'm ahead to get my big lotion and probably take some take some of that and put it in a small container or something because they don't have nothing and i'm literally about that i'm not telling you where i'm going yet but i'm going out the country and i don't know how that shit is out there who knows if i'm be able to find a store or anything so that's what i'm gonna do i'm about to just buy another big lotion and put some in like a smaller container i guess because what am i supposed to do I just think it's real funny. Oh wait, y'all just missed it. It was just 924, which is my birthday. But anyway, y'all, I just got on here just to close this video out. I'm so tired. I just booked in the house, so I'm about to finish picking. I did end up finding a um I did actually end up finding a um travel size lotion. I don't know if that's really small enough though. I'm not sure, but I did find a smaller one than like the regular size, but y'all, I'm so fucking tired. I just wanna get on here to close this video out. I'm going to talk to you when I talk to you. I don't know if I'm going to take a nap first and then get up and finish picking or finish picking and then just go to sleep so I could just wake up and go. I don't know. But I'm tired. I just wanted to close this video out. And I only got one minute left of course. I actually need to upload this footage to my computer so I can free the storage. But I love you. Bye. Make sure I like, comment, subscribe. See you on my next video. Part 2 of the B-Day. Bye.